sped up right after Pap's house. Yeah. I need to see two of things that happened there. Oh. All right. One, they wanted to see if we were out. Two, Pat might have yelled at them at what point, and they just wanted to cruise by there, you know? Yeah. Or three. Yeah. That's all you Or three. It's Pat. Everybody knows Pat. All right, make the video. Oh, you're making it. No. Nope. Is that focus good? Yeah. All right. Told you to do the intro. I don't know what we're talking about. I'm beating you with this frying pan. That's probably how where I was gonna start off. All right, we're gonna start off with uh, why this frying pan's behind us. Um, for now on, the loser news will be right here, and we'll get our table in here eventually. And uh, yeah, and this is the shed wall. And if you saw what kind of crap actually hangs on this <laughs> wall, uh, we would have to be sitting way up there. Because it's all sitting there and it's just out of the way. The shed's been cleaned up a little bit. Yeah. Yep. And some more electric thrown in here to get it brighter. And I'm pretty sure you guys are getting a very good view of white on us, I bet. Yeah. Because of that spotlight up there toward us. So, yeah. And one of the things I'm just not going to tear down are his speakers and his frying pan while we're doing this. So What's the hole for? Probably where Tommy had a wall put up or something. Upside down. Sorry. And uh, I probably didn't know that in very good. I said now it's just gonna. And I got these doors now up right here so they don't fall. You know. Yeah, you can see outside everywhere. Where the walls meet. Should have done an electric video. Ah, poop. Oh, sugar. <laughs> uh, we can do a little bit. Of, yeah, there's good light right here. You got a shadow back here. So like I said, you got the frying pans up on the wall, and you probably didn't see that or this hanging um yeah so I p what's this it was the old house curtains oh so there's the door you can't even see out of it because <laughs> he spray painted it um this is what hangs on the wall here by electrical wire you know you know the usual but this is all ropes and all hanging up right there there's just no room for it. something's burning in here okay. it's probably that stupid fan over there oh and, uh, so this is the, uh... Why is it working? Huh? The fan's not working. Oh. Um. What? I don't know. I didn't think I'd start that easy. Um, there's our spotlight for the video, and that's right here. Perhaps work... I cleaned this up. He's probably not going to be the happiest of this being cleaned. But I organized it as his... As he had it in here. Spray paint. Nails, sandpaper, rolls, all the above over there. Glues, poison, more nails, drills, electrical, car parts, the guy's tools. Bye. What? Huh? This is the mower paint. <laughs> oh. So, yep. And that Chris came in here. And I don't know if you Did we ever show him spray painting any of these? No. All right, well, this used to be black, green, gold, white. All colors. All the above colors that we could find. And so I've got a junk new cover and a junk switch for uh, the first one. does the main light in here. And the second one turns on and off all the outlets. And all the outlets have lights plugged into them and stuff. In the above there. Uh, the radio. You know, all the above. So I put all new lights. What are you doing? Covering up the spray paint that I tested on here. Alright, well. Got the outlet there. Plug in outlet there. The light in it. Like I said, workbench light, blah, blah, blah. Uh, is there something I needed else to show? No. Yeah, there was. There had to be something. Got the horn on the razor. Oh. Alright, it's put away. And it's still the usual. They don't know about your horn. Uh -uh. Why not? You never mentioned it. Oh, well, we got a horn for the razor, so it's not as good as I thought it would be, but it's good. That's a nice horn, somewhat. It's very loud, and you can't blow it for long periods of time. Or just... and this is where we put graffiti on the shed, and uh, he tried to put green on it. Then you know, well, he just got to put some black on it. The, the... the green broke. Put another cap on it. Uh, it was out of air in the can. 
uh, under the shed, in and out. So that means, here's the sh shed paint. <laughs> you want paint? You want to wait till next Friday? Here, come here. I'll get you a brush. I know where those are. Too. Don't use Pepsi brush. Got oh, paint. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get dirt right on the spot you need. Smart, dude. Oh, yeah. Put a light out here, too. This plugs in. Whatever. Alright. Crack the top. Uh, I need a... Uh... Yeah, about that. That might not work out. Bubba. This paintbrush is terrible. Yeah, because we used it. This is his what he paint, paint that over too. Alright. Uh, you video for a second. Video this bull crap. I'll drop my phone in the paint. Picture. Your yeah. phone. Yeah, same thing. You stole that. You stole my phone. I drop it. Right? No. Oh! Now he's stirred. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, I never stopped this. Where's that camera? What camera? That camera. Mm -hmm. Yep. Bop. Let's Is that a roller? No. It's a stir. <laughs> Stir. Look, stink bugs in it. Real nice. How did they get in that? They just crawled in like when we walked in there. Okay, you gotta do one thing. Huh. Don't paint this. Like... Right. Oh my god. <laughs> like that's gonna paint anything. He has thousands of brushes. Is that even the paint for this? <laughs> yeah. Oh jeez. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, what you said. Yeah. Oh, drip, drip. <laughs> That's it. This is how people take walls in the house. Yeah. I just want to see if there's any more junk brushes. Alright, this place is a mess. I don't see any. Would you want to paint with a knife? <laughs> that would work better. Alright, well, you're stuck with that anyways. You got a roller. Would you like to put your fingers in the roller and just kind of play it through there? Oh, we might find some goods in here. Are you serious? There's a radio in here. Let's put a radio. Hey, Will. Here's a serious horn. <laughs> uh, it looks that, is, like... that is a horn, I think. Unless it's a... Uh, oh. It's either... Uh, it's a fan. No, it's a horn. Uh, paint, paint, brush, brush, paint, paint, brush. Hey, Will. What? You're out of luck. It's already painted. Oh. What's the point? <laughs> Not really. Hey, it's good enough. It's looking better. He's gonna come out here. Man, no more orange, black, purple hat. That head that's on the garage actually looks like somebody. I looked and I thought I saw Pat watching. Doesn't it look like it? Uh-huh. Yep. Well, let's see, come over here and see what kind of paint needs done. Yeah, come back here and uh, when you're done, spray paint the stay back. Or not spray paint, the paintbrush here. and paint, paint, Paintbrush stay back. Oh, Will, you got paint on my outlet. Hey, what are you doing? I don't want to get it on this good cord. Oh, geez, that's the good cord? Wow. Isn't that a nice one? No, it's the oh. end of it. Oh. The good one's up there, it's coming to here. Well, I think I'm going to keep it hanging in the shed here. Or should we keep it in the uh, the lawnmower closet down there? Yeah, that's right. The lawnmower closet. Right? Yeah. Woohoo! What? Uh -huh. What? This. All right. Yeah, well, until Jared, or, uh, until somebody spray paints it. I don't know why I keep trying to say Jared. What? I keep going Jared, but I keep, because we're talking about Jared now, I meant to say. Well, you spray painted it, you idiot. Oh no, that was you. 
What happened to that lawnmower that was sitting here? We burned a lawnmower, so where'd it go? Are you serious? Gonna come up. Watch out. What is this? Piece of wall. Holy crap. It's much gore. No, no, crap, Hey, you can go like shopping. Hey, Will. You can go like shopping through here. You got all of the above. <laughs> like right here, we got some animal bedding, you know? Like, you I can. The new mattress over there. Oh, yeah, you can come down here to the mattress store and pick up a mattress and. You need the air conditioners, you can get that. Uh, need a little bit of scrap metal. Uh, uh, beer. Or, uh, electrical maybe, or, I don't know. Or a mattress. Oh. Dang it, well, this is gonna go another week without anybody touching. I think Pop's gonna burn it by then. What do you think? Two. don't know why there'd be two box springs. I should take them. They're probably infested with all of the above now. Pap ran over a skunk. Right, Will? Pap ran over a skunk. Ran over a skunk and it stinks throughout this whole section of the woods. So, that's to look forward for. Let's go up here. I'm gonna go shopping up here. Stay back on the very back. You can see it dark green and red. Yeah. I know. We're gonna find it. It's in the field, which you guys have not yet to see. Uh. Uh. This is just. Dead random. I don't even know. Ooh, a trash can. Use that in our area. Not our area. The area's done. I mean, like, it's built and everything right now. Like, everything that we got is there. It's not destroyed. It's not a, it's not a, it's not good looking. It's a wreck. It's just because it's just, you know, we don't care about it anymore. It's just, Useless. So we've converted this shed into half ours. Even though this is for sure. Now see it's pitch dark in here. Come over back in here. Come back over here. First, you go flip, flip. I'm telling them you gotta flip the switches before you plug this in or just blow sparks everywhere. And I don't feel like trying to plug this. <clears throat> the only thing that comes on is that. Because it's not all oh, you serious right now, Will. Okay. Then you come in here and flip the good ones on. What's all the spray paint back there? I'm coming. Well, remember when Pap had the small amount of spray paint? I was just going nuts. It's like lines of it everywhere. I didn't oh, finish. Pap did that. I didn't do the lines. Why? Huh? Why did he do that? Probably because, remember we put this section. He did something over here. And he didn't paint the new nails that he had on. So he spray paints it, you know how, you know. And I had this black, remember? It's gone now. Yeah. I have to get a can of dumb paint and just really slap it on there, you know? You know? This is going good. Why don't you weed whack back here, Tom? I didn't feel like it. Oh. Your nickname's Tom, right? Yeah. That's what I thought. Um, yeah. So right now I really just got like nothing else to say other than, yeah. You're not even painting, you're just slapping the wall, aren't you, Will? I'm slapping some stickers on my gear. Oh. You can see, it's like just a gaping hole at the top. I mean, if this was a shed, I guess, you know, you got, it's in a normal house, you got air vents at the top. Dude. I don't know if you realize that. There's practically holes at the top of your roofs that go into the attic, crawl space, whatever you want to call it. So really, having this opened up here isn't bad at all, am I right, Will? Yeah. Because if you think about Let's it, heat out. that, and it, um, like normal houses have this too, like every house has it, you know? Yeah. 
The only thing is, they got a cover on the outside, but a shed, honestly, you don't need it. Mine is in my attic. Crawl space attic, walk through, I don't even know what you want to call it. So, that's what you got going on here. And we need to put a ceiling in this shed. And that'll keep most of the heat out. But, if you walk down this wall, you see a crack there. See a light through there. You got light all the way down. So it needs some caulking right down the middle. You know? But this whole place is probably unlevel. Like, it's level, but I bet you it's just sinking in certain areas. I wouldn't be surprised if this just breaks one day. Would you? Yeah. Not really. No. Nah. Huh? So, that's what's crapping in over here. Keep an eye and tell me if it looks good. Like it's all up in there. Right? Mm -hmm. Move it to the left. Don't move it, just slide it. Right? Mm -hmm. Music. Alright, I want you to video, like actually hold it, and I'll talk about what I'm doing. Alright, this is a little bit of electric, getting done the shed, you can show them what it goes to right there. It goes to that outlet. This comes in from the power line from the street, yeah right, power line from the garage, comes in. I know, let me hear about it. And, uh, comes up into, yep, uh huh. Comes up into, I forgot about that. That sucks. Comes up into here, light above the outlets. Now, you're gonna go, what the heck? It goes from this to that outlet right there to an outlet that's back here that I forgot about. To this junction box, which goes to this switch. Yeah, I know you gotta turn on that to do this. But this is a safety switch for if we plug something in here that most likely gonna cause a fire, which most likely that's what we're <laughs> plugging in. Yeah. And then also a line goes underneath all the way to that outlet over there. So that's what we're doing here. There wasn't one over here? Mm. No. I'm um, here. Take this. And you get a little what's going on with the switch. Never done a switch electrical video. Take two black wires. Put them to the two screws on the un the only two screws on a normal switch that says on and off. Uh, you take the two neutrals, which is two white wires. You take your pars <laughs> and you what? my pars and you line them up and you twist these together like so. Make sure the brass is actually actually like twisted together. Brass? Is it brass or copper? Copper, brass. I think actually um I thought it was copper. Pretty sure that the you know you're making me sound stupid on this. I don't remember. Just take it out. Huh? Just edit it. That's fine. Um just twist them together. I'm pretty sure copper or one of the two you, you they're not allowed to be in houses anymore. Because they cause well they can be, they don't have to be ripped out. But they're dangerous. Push them in the back, which is kind of hard because, like I said, 10 gauged. You take these two wires. <laughs> Why are what, you talking like that? Because that's how you got to talk around the pencil tucky. Right? Mm -hmm. You twist these at the end, like this. You watching? Yeah. And then you trim the shortest one, which I would go with that one. Like like that. Ba ba ba. Keep twisting more. Trim it down even farther if you can. It's made out of copper. That's what I thought. Bra no, brass is the one that's. Bra there's brass screws. I know that. Um. And then you get another one of those green wire nuts, which. No, I'm not doing. And you're supposed to get another these, and then the wire will pop through it. Should I do that? Just a waste of them for the shed that gets turned on once a week. 
the electric's only in on this in once a, once a week, so I'm just, ow, it's barely even on. During that amount, like right now, hasn't been on today yet, except for like three seconds, and I zap myself. So, huh? All right, turn that off for now. What?